Thank you for buying this 8138 Plinko board from Figure Displays. These are all the components in this video. I'm going to show you step-by-step -step instructions how to assemble this unit. I encourage you to browse fixturedisplays.com for other products and services we have to offer. And you can search 18138 on our site to locate this item. These are other parts. We have the main frame, side panels, metal brace, and the base panel. To begin assembly, we want to fasten the side panel to the main frame. We're going to pull that toward the edge a little bit so we can access the side holes. Observe the bottom access point is loose at this point, and we're going to show you how to fasten that later on. We're going to line up the two holes on the side and fasten them with two screws. It would be nice to have one person to hold it, the other person assemble. However, one person is uh, definitely adequate to assemble this unit. If you have any questions, feel free to email us at cs.charliesam at fixturedisplays.com. Likewise, we're going to do the other side. Now we're going to fasten two metal braces to the side panel. These are reinforcement pieces, not really required, but once fastened, the entire unit is uh, uh, much, much stronger. Because a long piece of wood uh, can be flexible a little bit, once the metal is reinforced, the unit is much more solid. Now we're going to fasten the base panel, line up the two holes on the side and fasten two screws on each side. We also have a table topper uh, version. Search Plinko on our site should pull up the tabletop and wall mount unit as well. If you have a custom requirement, we'd be happy to quote you. Uh, it takes about three months from time to order to delivery. And lastly, we're going to fasten one screw to lock the front access door. I'm going to show you how the access door works very quickly. Lastly, we're going to fasten the access door, the metal um, access door, with a cam, uh, with a padlock that is supplied. Dimensions of this unit: left to right, 24.6 inches; front to back, 17.5 inches. The overall height is 60 inches, or about 1.5 meters. The unit weighs about 28 pounds net. We're gonna drop a few coins and a few bills. This unit takes coins and bills. The bill drop is only toward the lower portion because uh, dropping on the top uh, can become very messy and hard to retrieve. I must point out, in the unlikely event where your coin is stuck on the top portion, you do not want to turn that upside down because that can cause further congestion. You really want to just uh, uh, open up the front door and use a wire hanger of some sort to reach it. Now we're going to remove the padlock and use a container of some sort to catch your coins. We're now removing the bills. You will see there is one paper bill stuck in there. Uh, when you have a lot of coins, some coins may even stuck in there. And this is where the large front access door comes in. There's one screw, we're easy to operate, well, then we can lift it up and access all the money in there. If you have any questions, feel free to email us, cs the charlie sam at fixturedisplays.com. I hope you enjoyed this video. 
Remember, like us, subscribe, and remember, leave a good seller feedback along with a product review. We now put it on spinner. The spinner is not part of the purchase. We also make to order. Uh, if you have a special requirement, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to coach you. In addition to this Plinko game, we also have many other donation collection boxes. 10885, 10918, and 4 stands 11063 and 101065, to name a few. Once again, thank you so much for shopping fixture displays.